What is Alzheimer's disease? Alzheimer's disease is a progressive brain disease, meaning something that affects the brain and causes short-term memory, cognitive skills, as well as behaviors and even sleep changes in a person that's affected by the disease. Most people are unaware that Alzheimer's disease starts in the brain decades before the first symptom of memory loss begins. However, when that first symptom starts, it is essential to seek an adequate diagnosis and an adequate evaluation. Many people are confused. What is the difference between Alzheimer's disease and dementia? Let's first start with the term dementia. Dementia is an umbrella term that includes very a variety of different types of conditions that can affect memory and thinking skills. As opposed to Alzheimer's disease is by far the most common form of neurodegenerative dementia, meaning the brain declines over time. Alzheimer's likely affects at least 60 to 70% of cases with dementia, but often Alzheimer's is mixed with other types of dementias. For example, when a person has vascular disease, meaning problems with high blood pressure, high cholesterol and diabetes, the blood vessels in the brain may get clogged up and may no longer help to supply the brain with the oxygen and the nutrients it needs. So at least a third of the time that a person has Alzheimer's disease dementia, they may also have components of vascular cognitive decline. So the other types of dementias that you may have heard of include dementia with Lewy body, frontotemporal dementia, and Parkinson's disease dementia, to name a few. However, Alzheimer's disease is by far the most common, and it's also the area where we've made the most scientific progress. There are a variety of different therapies out there, from pharmacologic as well as non-pharmacologic. What do those two terms mean? Pharmacologic means drugs, vitamins, and supplements. Non-pharmacologic means behavioral interventions, such as caregiver support, and lifestyle changes such as exercise and nutrition. So overall, Alzheimer's disease is a brain disease that's very common. One out of about every 10 people over the age of 65 will develop Alzheimer's disease. And what's more, over the age of 85, at least a third or possibly up to 40% of people will develop Alzheimer's disease. It's not an inevitable part of aging, but it is a common disease that we can do something about today.